You know if y'all have been asking for Afrobeat guitar tutorial, so I decided to create one of them. In this video, I'll show you how to create realistic Afrobeat guitar melody for your beat. Let's have some fun. First, let's fix our tempo. We're gonna go 1, 12, something like that. And we're using the if the iPhone will have electric guitar LP, electric guitar. Little disclaimer, guys. I always want to create the same place guitar melody alphabet guitar melody it's not something complicated if you want something complicated this video is not for you i'm gonna try to create guitar melody with only two notes per chord first let's see you can find a uh, woods note and then once we find the woods note, we can add another note to complete the melody um let's start i think we're gonna go with a try to That's how that's how I would know. This all I would know. So next thing is gonna be adding another note to complete the melody. It's not not complicated at all guys. We're not trying to find one that sound nice with Okay, something like that. Mm. Get back right there. And next, we're gonna be adding some weaver. And I think I'm going to use this analog obsession um chanev. And let me try to see if we can add some. I think we're gonna transpose it like that. And now we add some, we maybe delay. Let's go with uh, first is delay to it. I think it's still I have too much low. Uh, let's see if we can do a slap delay. Nice. Now that we have this, we can maybe try to create a uh, core progression. So uh, let me add this pattern right here. And we can go to Alphabet Essentials Bundle. And then I maybe use uh, maybe the shaker right here. Our code gonna be maybe let's see this one maybe we can go with the major right here okay something like that and then we have it like that one octave higher. okay now 
comment B we have it like that boom okay now we're going to try to find a base so um, go to maybe fire and then go to bonus that use this sub base always go and play with the envelope uh, I think if you're a beginner you should know that when you play with the envelope like that when you press the note and then you release it there is no sound that means there is no release at all once you when you unpress you don't have any sound now we're going to play the wood note like something like that and then we can go right there normalize it so we can nice and let's go directly to the drums and maybe go to afro bd essential and then go to afro vibe let's try to find something okay co 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 top the basic afro bit button nice Go to Casa so we can find a kick. Uh, I'm a piano kick. I want. Let me go with Irby. See so if we can add a brass. I might use the natural session section. We can copy this right here, paste it right here. Turn it up, turn it up. Turn it, turn it, turn it. Turn it, turn it. Comment X, turn it, turn it, turn it, turn it. Sorry, sorry. So I'm gonna make it um, maybe let I'll Q we can quantize them. Ah nice. We can make it longer. Okay, I I I I think it's gonna be good. And, uh, and uh, we have this one right here and then this one right here we can just copy and then drag it right there and, uh, and we can transpose this one so we can have it at i not nice i love it i love it and then boom we can take this one Y here, we drag it, and then we sorry, we can take this one right here, and then we drag it like that. Woo! That's crazy, that's crazy, that's crazy, that's crazy, that's a vibe. Hey. I think the vibe is crazy if you're a beginner this is the best tutorial for you if you're a beginner guys this is gonna be very helpful so you can see that i start with same with single note and create the guitar pattern with two notes 
per code, not triad. And then after I add my composition and add a sub, add some drums, and then I come up with this nice wood white session, which is very nice. Now it's time to try to make the drums more interesting because we only add a kick, uh, an afro perk, and then the shaker. Now we're gonna try to add some conga and then make it sound more interesting. Let's start with this conga right here. Hey. and then um let's see if we can go find all the vibe or the conga um go and afro beat isn't not essential the afro hit for the moon this one was with mrp and then okay we're gonna use this one let me use this one and I think it is this one. We want to create something more interesting with the guitar uh, for the course. We can do. one and what let's see if we transport this one I don't like it mm -hmm. let solo this to see So that means we can have this right here for the chorus and then the other one for the verse. Let's play everything to start. Ooh, it's a vibe. Let's try to see if we can add now, uh, maybe. Some vocal chop just to try to add this sauce. You know, let's try this to see. Okay, let me record this one. I think I love this one. Now what we're gonna do is like we're gonna quick render as audio clip and then we have it. Boom. And now we can do everything that we want with it. So mute this one and then let's drag it over here. And we're gonna try to put it on time. First, let's go to tool and then go to macros and then go to real time stretching so we don't mess with the pitch. Now it's good. Now it's good. Now I love it. The next thing is to add a bunch of reverb. Reverb, footy converter. Now guys, I'm gonna use my favorite drum fill right now. What that this works always. And then we can go to um Afro piano, Amapiano, sorry, 
and then we go to break we use the uh, M, M hack there and then and then we get back with this club nice vibe and i enjoy create this one it is so nice and simple at the same time yeah i'm not gonna do any android on this one because i think i'm gonna work more on mixing maybe add uh, some little melody i don't know yet and then drop it on my instrumental channel now i'm gonna let you enjoy the vibe we create That's it, thanks for watching. I hope now it's easier for you to create realistic guitar melodies for your beat. If you have questions, please leave a comment. See you guys in the next one.